All right. So now we can warp here, which is good because I'm gonna explore this area soon too. So I think I should warp here and check out the rest of these mountains because I need to check out all this mountain before we check out the left side of this map with that big giant maze. The maze might have to wait. Oh man, that might have to either wait tomorrow. If I can do that tomorrow, because I can't be up too late tomorrow because I have to do something on Wednesday. So hopefully that maze doesn't take me too long to do. I want to do as much of this region as possible tonight. It's already 10 because I started super late. I, I, I had the perfect start to the day. I woke up, got some exercise in, had breakfast, showered and everything. I did some lawn work, and then when I sat down in front of my battle station to get ready to stream, I was tired, I was like, what the heck? So I was like, you know what, fuck it, stream's gonna be two hours late, gonna pass out for two hours, threw on a podcast, you know, I sat in the same very chair, slept for two hours, woke up at six, was, all right, I think I have the energy to stream now, so now we're back here. And I was like, what happened? I had everything I could ask for, and I still couldn't <laughs> stream on time. But, uh, that's the way she goes, man. I knew I was going to play Zelda all day anyway, so Zelda's not going anywhere. And neither was Animal Crossing. Oh, I forgot, I must eliminate all wolves, because a wolf killed a fox right before my very eyes. And, uh, the wolf tribe is dead to me now. More dead to me. Whoa, don't fall, don't fall! No, fuck! Oh, man. Well, now this one's gonna be frozen, probably. Can this one not be frozen, please? I don't care about frozen meat. Alright, well, thank God. How about this one? Where is this one? Is that all the way down there? Nope. Cool. Jaden's hopping on Smash. Alright, but yeah, so... A wolf killed a fox in front of my very eyes, so now I have to kill all wolves. Because the foxes, we have we have a truce with the foxes because the foxes haven't attacked me yet for any reason. I thought the wolves were cool too, but the wolves are bastards. So, now we're at a blood war with the wolves. And, um, where am I going? Am I going the wrong way? Yeah, I technically am. I should turn around. Um, now we're at, we have a blood war with the wolves. And the foxes had their first victim ever because they never killed a fox. I haven't killed a fox yet. And the wolves killed a fox right in front of me, so now I have to destroy all wolves. So, that's how my adventure is going. Hopefully, um, your guys' adventure also unfolds in a strange, weird way like that, too. Because, trust me, in the real world, I love wolves. Wolves are cool animals, you know. I like foxes, too, but I like wolves more in IRL. However... This game, wolves are little bastards, and they killed a fox. A fox, which is a normally docile creature in this game, they do not attack people like that, like that, you know? I don't know if there's something I have to do with this girl sell me, but I don't remember how to shield surf, so I can't really do anything. I'm gonna take this, all her wood and stuff. I don't really want this torch. This is, that's a, that's gonna take a space. Like, I'm sure she has something to do for me in regards to shield surfing. But until I can figure out how to shield surf, then I'm not gonna sweat it because, like, I'm just, like, why am I still going this direction? Is this where I'm supposed to go? Where am I supposed to go? I don't mean to be going this direction. Is this sell me spot? Let me turn around once again. I thought I was going the right direction. Why, why am I lost in the mountains? This is not a good sign of, like, my survivability. I like how she just has a whole tune playing for her house. This hasn't been a single thing like that in the entire game, except for her, apparently. She has, like... She has music playing for her OST, which is pretty cool, I guess. Um, you know, honestly, I could just warp there instead of walking there. But I want to check out the rest of this. I kind of had to walk. Damn it. Alright. The snow levels? I gotta say, while some of them are nice, I'm not an overall fan of them. 
I'm at the point in the game where I can move through snow pretty fast, and I don't have to worry about, like, you know, walking at 40% speed through the snow. So, I don't know, it's not too bad. It's, it's better than it used to be. Alright, now we gotta go this way. But, the first few snow levels were not super fun. When you had a, when your speed was decreased to 30%. Alright, let's see what else we can find around here. Perhaps another Lionel, just like kind of vibing out here. Drop a star fragment. That's never happened to me. I never had a Lionel drop a star fragment. That was totally random. Looks like there's a lake coming up, so hopefully. H Hello? Can I help you? Are you trying to assault me, sir? The roof's protection is now ready to roll. <laughs> Fucked up, man. I would have left you alone, but you had a nice broadsword on you, so I kind of needed it. Eliminate all wolves. Watch out, Mr. Moose. I don't want to attack you. I must eliminate all wolves. We are having a blood war. Quit running from me, you coward. Oh, you tried to juke me out, huh? Maybe you wasted that's your bow. Or arrow, rather. Nope, you didn't. I picked it right back up. I must eliminate all wolves. We are in the middle of a centuries-long blood war with the wolf tribe. It's all because they did damage to me once, like, a hundred hours ago in terms of gameplay, and then they attacked a fox who we have a truce with. So now I have to eliminate all wolves. I wish it didn't have to be this way, man. I really do. Gotham secret hot spring? Who's Gotham? And why is this hot spring a secret? I think I'm already at full health, so I can't heal here. But it's nice that this is here. Is there anything else right here? On my PC now, so I won't have stream delayed. That's what's up, man. Welcome back. What's going on, Pichu? Um, uh, what is this? Is this supposed to be set ablaze for some reason? Ooh, core seed. I asked my sister how she got Raymond. Oh, Raymond. She says she paid 7 million bells for it. That is quite the price for Raymond. 7 million bells? That's... That makes sense. I thought his price was much higher than that for some reason, but 7 million bells. I don't need to have 7 million bells, and I have a lot of bells. 7 million... Sorry, I did not mean to put this rock back on you. Um, 7 million bells sounds about right. That, that is a lot. I think I have 4.5 uh, 4. million bells. I'm glad I got them for free, that's for sure. Also, she's asking what animal friend you, you need is Ion. Also, she's asking what animal friend you need is Ion. Like, how is it spelled? Arion? I don't know. It's, it's like, it's like Ione or something. I, even call, I call her Ion because, um... I don't know, but I think people call her Ione because she's kind of like Persephone, the goddess of love, I believe. Is Persephone love? No, Persephone is is winter and spring, right? It's it's like that. She, I think she's Grecian, so she's like um she her name is like Persephone or Aphrodite, so it's it's technically like probably Ione, but I just call her Ione. But it's, it's either I think it's Ione probably because there's an e at the end of it. But it's like, I, I say Ion or Ione. I, I think Ion's a little bit cooler, but Ione for her sounds cute. So it's whatever. It's spelled with the E. It's Ion with the E. It's, it's the blue squirrel with, with starry tail. <laughs> it's, it's not, it's really hard to really explain. She's a blue squirrel with a starry tipped tail. 
What species is it? It's the squirrel. It's the squirrel. Hey guys. Oh, you froze me. Got a giant boomerang. And this fucking coward. Watch his fucking friends die right in front of me. He didn't even do anything about it. So now you're gonna get obliterated. Alright, let's see what else we got around here. Um, this area. We got the crossy, so I don't really think there's anything else here. If there is, uh, it's kind of whatever. You see a lot of wildlife and monsters, so let's keep climbing. See how we can find this frozen tundra of wasteland. Imagine if I climbed this hill, just uh, Lionel was just right there. It's like, oh man, Lionel. Another one? I could fight it. I have all the health and weapons I need, but still, imagine. I'll be like, I'll be like damn. So I expect to see you here, sir. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey. Be careful, Mr. Moose. I don't want you to trample me with your great big antlers. I don't want to get trampled by a moose. That's not the way to go. In my opinion. Alright, he were North Crest. I think I'm going to fall down there. Am I going to climb up here real fast though? I think I will. I think I'll climb up here real fast and then I'm gonna jump down. Let's see what we got up here. If anything, you know, I like to be thorough in my expeditions through these areas. If there's something I can find, I would like to find it. If there's something I cannot find, then I'll search for it. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. Oh, my nice broadsword, huh? Got a drill shaft. A moblin arm? I don't think I really meant to pick that up, but it's whatever. Kind of want that dragon bone moblin spear instead, actually. If I may. Pop this up real fast. What's up? What do you got? A royal bow! Attack of plus 10, you say? Well, I don't really need any more bows. We have all the bows we could ask for now. Alright, what else do we got, man? What else is up here? Got some shit. We got some stuff. Which way am I going? I should check over here real fast just to make sure. You say? Mipha's grace is ready. Thank you, Mipha. I'll need you in case you run into another Lionel out here for some reason. Alright, have I been up there? Yes. Technically, yes. Alright, um, we haven't been down here, but I don't think I'm gonna check that just yet. I could. Yeah, I guess I could. Because he already been up here. Let me uh, make sure I'm looking at. I'll check out the rest of this area real fast and then, uh. 
Eliminate all wolves. Eliminate all wolves. The blood war rages on with the, myself and the wolf tribe. They made the foolish mistake of attacking me and doing damage to me. And I was like, dude, what the fuck? I wasn't even hunting wolves at that point. And then suddenly, for some reason, they attacked me. I was like, what the fuck? Well, I gotta kill you all. And then to top it off, they attacked and killed a fox right in front of my very eyes. And that's when I knew. Man, these wolves ain't shit. <laughs> Eliminate all wolves. Eliminate all wolves. I am the Terminator. Alright, so this is the hot spring. We've already been here. Um, Alright, yeah, I think we're good. Let's uh, continue to Hebra North Crest. She says she doesn't have it. She has nine casts in the bunny. That's fine, dude. I don't. It doesn't matter. Um, I'd rather not have Ion be a freebie. I'd rather try to find her myself before just having it given me, given to me for free. I like working for things, cause then the reward is that it's that much sweeter, you know. It's that much sweeter, you know. Nine cats. Does she have Olivia? Does she have Olivia, the white cat with red ears? That's my favorite NPC ever. <laughs> Olivia is my favorite. Is that why you have a Twitch account? Um, well, Twitch basically is a hobby. Anyone who supports the Twitch is fucking great, but um, that's just uh, me passing my spare time. Please don't tackle me off the mountain, please. Twitch is just a hobby I do my spare time while I'm in between jobs. Anyone who decides to follow me, that's all I need. That and I want to make friends. I have zero friends on the West Coast. Oh, you're running from me. You're not gonna howl for battle? Wise wolf. Let me ask, you don't own Olivia? I have Olivia. I have Olivia. I just wanna know if she has Olivia because she has nine cats and Olivia is must be one of the nine cats because there's not there aren't a lot of cat characters in Animal Crossing. So I wanna know if she had Olivia because Olivia is my favorite cat, aside from Anka. Who's walking across the screen right now as we speak in Raymond? But Raymond's not my super favorite. I just like having him because it's clout. So that people can look at Raymond and say, I spent $30,000 on Raymond. You got him for free? He's like, Yep. I sure did. Found him on Nook Mile Ticket Island. Got him for free. He is totally ungifted, which means if someone bought him, he, you can get a pure Raymond with no items equipped. But that doesn't interest anybody. No, no. Caught slipping. Caught you slipping, sir. Alright, I need to wrap around to the North Heber Spring. I think I checked out the the most of this mountain up here, so now we're gonna wrap around the North Heber Spring. Why are you aiming for wolves? Is it a quest? No, this is a joke. It's just a long running joke. I think that's the wrong way. I don't know, that's not where I'm supposed to go. A wolf did damage to me a long time ago. And ever since then, I've been hunting wolves. And now, just today, I, I watched a wolf kill a fox, totally unprompted. And now I'm attacking all the wolves.
Also, you should make a clan for Battle League. I'm pretty sure I do have one. I haven't messed with it yet because I've been just practicing on the championship cup. I'm gonna kill a moose to see what I can get from killing a moose. What kind of meat do you drop? Raw gourmet meat? Okay, I just wanna see. Normally, don't hunt moose because they have not offended me yet, but I wanna see what kind of meat they drop. They drop raw gourmet meat, which is pretty good. Alright, Hebra North Crest. Am I gonna jump down there? I think so. Oh, there's a bomb rock wall there. I'm glad I checked. Here, come on so I can kill you and you don't fucking bother me. God damn it, how do you get past me? Fuck you. Alright, but yeah, um... I, I gotta mess with it more. I'm uh, still grinding a uh, championship cup. Or just like Galactic Cups. I gotta do the Championship Cup on Wednesday. And that's when I'm gonna do it. And then after that, then this is like online gameplay probably. And that's when I'll mess with the clubs shit. I have one. I just haven't messed with it yet. Probably when I'm done playing this game, I'll play Battle League a lot more often. Because I'm not gonna start another main big game at the scale of Zelda or Dragon Quest for a while. Not until Zelda Breath of the Wild 2, not until Dragon Quest 12. So a lot of the games I'm going to be playing are going to be pretty small in comparison. And just for me to chill out and have fun with and not have to take serious with the content or just me grinding like crazy for items and gold and everything else. Oh, my nose. I can't see. Alright, was that Dragon Ball Mom's Spear? Do I have any weapons to drop? Nope. Okay. Got a lot of guarding weapons. I don't know when that's ever going to go away, but... Now we got garden weapons. I'm ready to fight a Lionel. Um, she said, what? She said, no, she has Lolly. That's her favorite resident. Oh, that's what's up. Yeah, you didn't even finish the Battle Cups yet. We can start a club without being CPUs. I know, but I want to. Also, I sent you a Twitch clip on Discord. Right, I'll check it out later. <clears throat> is it related to me or is it related to somebody else? All right, um, let's check out the Hebrew North Crest. See what else we can find around here. Hello, Mr. Fox. Do not fear. I will never hunt you. All right, so let's see. Nothing up here? What's down there? Oh wait, I think this is the end of the path and the up there was the continuation of said path. Okay, well, is there anything else I can see from over here? Maybe? Maybe, baby. What's that? Something down there. Ooh, a diamond! Nice! Um... Oh, it's a video of bad RNG with the goalie of a different Twitch streamer. Do you have Lolly? No, I don't. Um... The version she has are Bob. Everyone has Bob. Raymond's cool. Lolly, Anka, Kiki, Mary, and Tagby. I know some of them by name. I have Raymond and Anka in, uh... And uh, what's the similarity in common? Punchy and Kabuki. Kabuki's cool. He's not. He's not one that I, that I went and sought out. A lot of the ninja, uh, Animal Crossing characters look kind of like meh to me. All right, this this shrine. It has to be up there. It has to be because I've been here the shrine forever now, and it has to be up there. It has to be up there. It has to be. A lot of the ninja Animal Crossing villagers don't really look that cool to me. Like, 
was the name Genji or Genki, and then the, you just said Kabuki, not my super favorite, and Coco. Coco's that bunny with like that looks like a Lloyd with the hollow dot eyes. Everyone likes Coco. She's cool though. I think I I think my villager list is gonna be the most goaded though, once I finally get everybody. It's gonna be the most goaded. In my opinion. You know, some people can disagree, but it will be wrong! It will be wrong to disagree! But it's all to you, man. It's all your personality. Alright, what's down there? That, that looks like there's something down there. Have I been down there? I thought I have. Yes, I have. Alright, where's the shrine at? Come on. It's nearby. I just don't see it. I just don't see it. Ooh, are those wolves? No, don't you run from me. Don't you run from me! What the? Come back here. Uh, Alright. What's that right there? A bomb of a wall? Here you go. A chest treasure. Shock arrows, okay, I'll take those too. I'll take anything I can. If I don't have to buy or pay for it, you know. I think the shrine's farther up there. What else is on this level of the mountain? Anything? Anything at all? I already did that shrine over there. That's that shrine. Alright, well, I guess I gotta climb. Let's climb. Oh. Right on. Alright. Alright, that's where shrine somewhere. I'm actually amazed about this game. So much content, not even a uh, co-op mode. What's that thing that keeps making the ring sound? That's my shrine finder. It lets me know if there's a shrine or a dungeon nearby. I keep it on because it helps me find a shrine. It's nearby, and as soon as I find it, it will be... It will stop ringing. But I need it. It's like a radar. I need it to keep buzzing so that I can find what I'm looking for. Whoa, be careful. Watch where you're pointing that horn, sir. I do not wish to start another blood war with yet another tribe of animal people. All the wolves I have slain along this path of mine. It has not been a righteous path. Yeah, this game does have a lot of content. In terms of co-op, uh, that would be interesting to see how it would be implemented because, I mean, like, you can literally go wherever you want. And, I mean, like, yeah, I guess two people can tend to go wherever they want, but, like, what's the point of co-op if two people can literally just, like, never interact with each other? <laughs> you know, because, if, if, like, if you both start here, we both start here at the Shrine of Resurrection. Oh, shit. I want to show you my, the path I went. It's a long path, but I'm not going to go through the whole thing. You know, it's, 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 a, it's a mess. But, like, if you both start here, at the Shrine of Resurrection, like, if it was co-op, one, two, or three, or four players, I mean, yeah, that sounds like it would be fun if we all, like, kind of hung out together and stuck together, but, like, it's a giant fucking game, so, like, why would you even do that? I could go to Gurudu Desert, someone else can go to Lanayru, someone can go to Akala, and someone else can go to Death Mountain, so it's like, sure, I, I mean, I could see it, but, like, you would have to be really close together for each other, for it to be fun and make it worthwhile, because, like, why... I don't know, to me, like, why would I play this big open game but only stick around one person when I could literally go forge my own adventure? Which I think is a little bit more fun. Some games require co op, some don't, in my opinion. Alright, so that is the Korok seed that I already got. There's another Korok seed over here that I haven't got yet. Alright, Hero North Summit. Alright, so where have you been so far? I haven't been through there. 
think I should check that. But I am making my way towards that area. So perhaps before I go any farther left, I should check that little area down there. Let's do that. All this for 60 bucks, just look at other Nintendo games. No other no Nintendo game would put this much effort in. If they did, they charge more. That is true. They definitely sold this game for 60 bucks a pop, and they, uh... But that's the, that's the thing with Zelda. Zelda has brand recognition. You know, it's like, it's hard for Zelda to mess up. And it's hard for Nintendo to mess up Zelda. And if they did, then people will let them know. It's not hard It's not hard to mess up a Zelda game. And they know what, they, what Zelda fans want. You know, it's not like... It's not a hard formula to master a Zelda game. It's not hard at all. In my opinion. I haven't played every single one of them, but I know what every one is about, basically. And it's not hard to make a good Zelda game. You just gotta do what fans like and shit. Especially in this day and age. We're not fucking children anymore, so... Let's have some more cooler adult things, maybe, in Zelda games. Not Maybe not just super straight-up R-rated, but, like, let's, let's have... Let's make cool shit happen, you know, like every Zelda game doesn't need to be E for everyone, you know, even Twilight Princess was T or teen, I think. Alright, um I have I checked out that pond? There's something here, right? What is that? Have I been here? What is this? It's a pond. It is a pond, but I don't know what for. What is this here for? Is there a crossy spot here, perhaps? I don't know what this is for. So, let's turn back around and we're gonna, um, we gotta check out the other direction there. This area. The connecting area. Look at the Pokemon games. OMG, they added a sprint function. We're charging 10 bucks more and adding like two Pokemon and nothing else. Yeah, they got a lot to do for Scarlet and Violet, because, like, Sword and Shield, as far as I could tell, like, people liked it, but for some reason they were still complaining about it, and I couldn't really begin to tell you why, maybe someone else in chat can, but I didn't play those games, so I can't really say anything about them. However, Scarlet and Violet look like they are gonna try, hopefully. Not that they didn't try with Sword and Shield, it's just that on the Switch, Pokemon should be doing more. So fucking um, what's that little fox? How are you doing? Um, on the Switch, Pokemon should be doing way more than what they are doing. In Sword and Shield, whether that was a good representation of what they can do, or just a test, or what they, or maybe they're just saying, hey, we're not as far as we're going, we're not gonna do anymore. Then that's Pokemon. Pokemon, once again, like Zelda, has brand recognition. They know, but it's just by being Pokemon that they will sell. So they can make the shittiest, dumbest Pokemon game ever in terms of story, plot, everything. People will still buy it because, oh, I can catch Pikachu! And it's like, yeah, of course, you can catch Pikachu. He's in every game. So it's not really, like, hard for them to mess up Pokemon. And if they did mess up Pokemon, then they would know. But you see it all the time. Even when Sword and Shield did come out initially, people were saying whatever they wanted about the graphics and the trees or whatever. But, like, people still bought the game, people still played it. And then no one cared after that. So, if Pokemon fans really, really wanted Game Freak to change, they would vote with their wallets, which, which they never do, by the way, because they still buy the Pokemon games, because not everyone cares, by the way, and then also, um, there's something over here I need to check out, but I'm not going to go that far, I'm going to keep going this way, it is 11 now, oof, god, these snow areas, dude, alright, um, Pokemon fans need to vote with their wallets, basically, and, um, and make and make Game Freak change if they want. Like I don't know what they want them to change. For me, I just want Pokemon games to be a little more challenging. I think Pokemon games are very, 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 very easy nowadays, especially with all the gimmicks and shit. I don't think they showed they showed off the new gimmick for Scarlet and Violet. I hope it's not like oh giant form or Super Saiyan Pokemon form or whatever. It's like I just want a nice challenging Pokemon game. You know, like, is that too much to ask for? Or is the entire fan base fucking 12 and now our rivals have freaking the Pokemon that is weak against the ones we chose, which is just the dumbest thing. That's like the biggest slap in the face to me at least. I'm like, dude, rivals used to beat your ass. Like, they're not supposed to have like, oh, you chose the fire type? 
Pokemon, I'll choose the grass type ones. Like, who thought that was a good idea in Pokemon? <laughs> That's when I knew I'm too old for Pokemon. <laughs> Alright. But I'm praying to God that Scarlet and Violet bring me back in. Because I, I miss playing Pokemon games. I want only play old Pokemon games or older ones. I'm only 25, you know? But I played up to a freaking, um... Gen 5? No, no, Gen 6. That's X and Y, right? I played that one. That was when I knew I'm too old for Pokemon. However, you guys want to duel? Let's duel. But, like, freaking, um... When I played X and Y, that's when I knew I was too old for Pokemon, so I haven't touched Pokemon since. However, I'm hoping that Scarlet and Violet might either prove me wrong or just, do, just does something really cool that makes me want to like Pokemon again, you know? Because me, me and all my brothers are down to get Violet. Or Scarlet and Violet. I'm getting Violet. I think my little brother is Scarlet, or Violet too, for some reason. I don't know why he is, but he is. And then my older brother is getting Scarlet because he always gets red. He always gets the red color. But I am definitely getting Violet. Even though the Violet does not have the waifu. It has the guy, which I'm a little salty about. Oh, Silver Rupee. I'll take it. Maybe I'll get the dual pack and I'll get Scarlet for the waifu and Violet for the legendary. I think Violet's supposed to represent the future, which I'm all about. Like, who wants to go back in time? Lame. I'm all about the future, bro. I'm all about the future, bro. Cyber Bionics and Cyber Kinetics and Starlink and Neuralink and Tesla. And Samsung Galaxy S30 plus XW. <laughs> That's what I'm waiting for. Who wants to go back in time? Back to the old rotary phones? Or the uh, messenger pigeon? Literally that, yeah, those dumb Mega Pikachus and shit. Like, like that's it, like, bruh. No, seriously, that, I mean, like I said, like that, that, that's not for me. If you, if you like X and Y and all that stuff, then fine, dude, but that's not for me. And that's when I was like, yeah, I'm, 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 maybe, I'm maybe I'm a little too old for Pokemon. So that's when I kind of just stopped and fell off. All right, this shrine is somewhere, but I'm not finding it at all. I don't need to go up this mountain again. It has to be in this direction. This is the top of this mountain. Trying to find a shrine. The only shrine I could find is that one over there. But like I said, I want to be proven wrong. Like, I don't want to only, you know, critique Nintendo. Like I would love to praise Nintendo one day. You know, they got they got some praise from me in this game. I th I'm hoping to God in the second one that there are more monsters and freaking um, you know, everything else is improved tenfold. I'm finding a lot of these bottom walls. Is this my shrine? Probably not. Um, I don't want to only critique Nintendo. I would love to praise Nintendo, but like you know. For some reason, some of the games they some of the games stick, and some of the games just don't for me. But I have a specific taste. I have a very specific taste for my games, so I can't speak for everyone. I speak purely for myself. Uh, Link, get up there! No, up there, up there! I'm I know Link. I know. I thought I messed out your stamina, Link. I thought you were made to climb mountains. Alright, where is this tower? Or this uh, thing, dude? It's not the very bottom of the, of the area. It has to be like on this level. I'm wrapping back around it here anyways. I, I, this is the direction I should be going in anyway, so I'm not super upset about it. Maybe it's on this side of the mountain. Maybe it's on this side of the mountain. I'll check. I'm gonna get there soon anyways. 
Once I saw Mega Pikachu, I knew it wasn't challenging anymore. Well, I messed out the strongest Pokemon. No NPC can defeat me now. I mean, that's that's, that's my thing with Mega Evolutions and Z moves and shit like that, and like Gigantamax. Like I don't know if it added anything competitively or like just to the story or the gameplay or whatever. But like, if you can do a move that one shots a Pokemon, what's the point? Like, where is the strategy? Is it, is it whoever Mega Evolves first? Oh, my drill bit broke. You know what I'm talking about? Like, come on. It's like, yes, my, my Mega Lucario can one-shot everything. So, like, who is going to... What trainer is going to fight me, dude? What trainer is going to actually try to come at me? No other trainer can Mega Evolve except for me. <laughs> it's like, are you kidding me, dude? That's fucking weird. Can I help you? Can't you see I'm busy? But yeah, I don't know. That's just me. I'm wild not being extra though. Alright, uh, well, there's a lake here. Let's check out the lake. Maybe the lake has a clue. Oh, this is the lake right here. Hello, little fox. Do not be afraid. Is there another hot spring? Surfin's secret hot spring. All right. Oh, well, I like the sound a lot. I find a lot of hot springs lately. You can't heal because we're already at max health, but. That's oh, nice to find them. I would love to bathe in a nice hot ass hot spring, dude. Like that's that's like my that's that's on the bucket list right there. I want to see the Aurora Borealis bathe in a hot spring, go to Japan. Oh, excuse me, sir. Um, what else? What else do I intend on doing with my life? Well, just travel more in general. That's for sure. Alright, so that's is that all that's over here? Not a not a shrine or nothing? We can climb up this wall. See if there's anything on this side of the mountain. I'm praying to god I can find a shrine, because it's gonna bother me if I don't find it tonight. I'm gonna be really, 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 really a setting. <clears throat> Alright, is that the direction I'm going? Yeah, basically. I think the shrine is on this side of the mountain. I don't know why I was hearing it from like all the way on the other side of the mountain, but I think it's on this side of the mountain. <clears throat> Excuse me. God, my mouth. I mean, my, my lungs or my chest or whatever. Whatever causes you to cough, I've just been coughing like crazy lately. I don't know why. I always gotta clear my throat. My throat. Oh, hello. You too. You too, sir. You too. 